I'm going to show you some of the easiest tostadas you will ever make. I make these all the time and they are so quick and easy, especially for dinner when you don't want to cook. And the avocado salsa that I make with these, I can eat it with pretty much anything. Here we go. Easy and delicious. So here's what makes this so easy. Get a rotisserie chicken from the grocery store and I'm just going to shred this for all its meat. And I am going to show you how I make this sauce. I'm going to be using some jalapeno, pickled jalapeno specifically, and the, the vinegar, the pickling liquid from the jar, a little bit of water, salt, and one large ripe avocado. Here we go. Okay, so here in my food processor, I've already added my large avocado oops, into the mix or into the food processor. <laughs> Now I'm going to add the pickling liquid from the pickled jalapenos, maybe three to four tablespoons. And I'm also going to add some, just a little bit, you don't want it too, I mean if you want it spicy you can. I'm going to go with a couple of those. Here we go. I'm also going to go in with, in with a little bit of water to start. salt to taste and now I'm going to puree Let's see if I can get this on right there we go so you take your tostada you add your guacamole or your avocado sauce right on top you can season your chicken. This is salted and seasoned. It's from the grocery store, it's rotisserie, so it does come pretty seasoned and marinated and salted. Some sour cream. This is Mexican sour cream with a little bit of cotija cheese. You can add some slices of your jalapeno. You can do it right there on top. So I'm going to give it a try. I know it's good, I do this all the time. Mm. This is seriously so simple to make and so good. And you don't have to pick up a rotisserie chicken. You can boil it, bake it, and shred it, and season how you like. It's so good. Going in for another bite. 